The LAV UP, UP for Upgraded, or LAV 6.0 was developed by General Dynamics Land Systems. It is an upgraded version of the Canadian LAV-3 Kodiak Armored Personnel Carrier. Upgrades are based on the lessons learned by the Canadian Army during combat operations. In 2011 the company was awarded a contract to upgrade 550 Canadian Army LAV-3 vehicles. In 2012 the deal was modified to provide additional 66 reconnaissance vehicles to replace Canadian Coyote reconnaissance vehicles. It seems that the first upgraded LAV-6.0 vehicle was delivered to the Canadian Army in 2015. It was planned that all of these 616 Canadian vehicles will be delivered until 2017. These uprated vehicles will form the backbone of the Canadian Armoured Vehicle Fleet. It is planned that these vehicles will remain operational until 2035. The LAV 6.0 and its modified versions are being proposed for export customers. The upgraded LAV 6.0 weights significantly more than the original LAV 3. A fully upgraded vehicle with add-on armour kit weights just over 28T. Protection has been improved, though many of the core design elements remain the same. The most notable difference of the upgraded LAV 6.0 is a double V-shaped hull. It was added for improved protection against landmines and improvised explosive devices. Crew members and passengers are seated on energy-absorbing seats. Vehicle retains a ceramic add-on armor kit of the original LAV 3. It looks like with this kit maximum level of all-round protection is against 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds. Some sources claim that front arc can withstand hits from 30mm cannons. Cage armor can be installed for protection against anti-tank rockets. Vehicle is fitted with automatic fire suppression and NBC protection systems. Currently the LAV 6.0 is one of the most protected armored personnel carrier in the world. The baseline Canadian Army vehicle has a two-man turret, armed with an M242 Bushmaster 25mm chain gun. It fires standard NATO 25mm ammunition. This weapon has an effective range of 2.4 kilometers. Both gunner and vehicle commander can fire the gun. There is also a coaxial 7.62mm machine gun. Another 5.56mm machine gun is located on top of the roof. Other weapons can be also fitted. Saudi Arabia ordered the LAV 6.0 armored personnel carriers armed with 20 and 30mm cannons. The upgraded Canadian vehicles have improved fire control system. It has an integrated target detection, recognition and identification system. It automatically corrects for target range and crossing speed. Turret sites have also been upgraded. The new thermal site and intensification site have extended ranges. So overall surveillance capability of the vehicle improved. The gunner can spot a man at a range of 1.2 kilometers. Furthermore the LAV 6.0 has got a new battlefield management system. This armored vehicle is operated by a crew of three, including commander, gunner and driver. It accommodates six to seven dismounts. Troops enter and leave the vehicle through the rear ramp with integral doors. Also there are roof hatches for firing or emergency exit. The upgraded LAV 6.0 is fitted with a more powerful engine. The new Caterpillar engine develops 450 horsepower, opposed to 350 horsepower in the original LAV 3. Upgrades were made to drive train and suspension to coupe with increased engine power, as well as increased overall weight. Despite increased weight the upgraded LAV 6.0 can match mobility of the original LAV 3 Kodiak. The LAV 6.0 is not amphibious.